that we are vibing, so don't play shy. Give me all your loving, cause I enjoy the way you move your body. Yeah, slow it down. Slow it down. Hello, how you doing? Welcome, Hi. welcome, welcome. First time here? Uh, we've been here before. Okay, nice. Take your shoes off. Come on. It's fine, we're blazes. Let's see, where are they? There she is! Look, Brooklyn! What's up? Ready, set, hi! <laughs> hi, Blaze! Hi, pretty girl! Hey! Oh my god! <laughs> it's hard to stand up in. Blaze. Brooklyn. Look at this heart in her hair. Say hi! hi. <laughs> Go, Brooklyn, go! And okay. don't hit your head, because I already did it a million right. times. Ready, <laughs> set, go! Jump! Yeah. Jump! Yeah. 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 This was a blessing to see both of our children able to play with each other. Like, for years, I've been with Kenya and rooting her on and praying for her. And now, here Brooklyn is, being a big sister to my daughter, who I would had to go through IVF and a surrogate to get. Brooklyn, don't wait. Don't just grab my purse. These two little girls playing together is just amazing. This is fun. Yeah, the kids love this place. Popcorn. Would you like some popcorn? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, so how do you ask mommy? May I have some popcorn, please? Yes, you may. OK. <laughs> I love the way she talks. <laughs> She's like a little character. Hi. Hey, how you guys doing? Is it possible we can get one baby popcorn yeah, no and one adult? Here, baby. Now sit next to Brooklyn. Go see if Blaze wants some. Sit with Brooklyn. <laughs> <laughs> good girl. You're such good girl. We have some good girls. Well, that one right there, she be acting up sometimes. <laughs> We're home but she good today. <laughs> she has moments, but she'll grow out of it. Uh-oh, she's on the run. We got a runner. Oh, she got up. You OK? Yeah, that was a little hard fall. She's trying to decide if she wants to cry. <laughs> and when she doesn't get her way, ooh, yes. ooh, oh my gosh. <laughs> girl. I had so much fun. OK, girl. With your tipsy self. <laughs> like this. <laughs> that drink was strong. <laughs> I enjoyed the laughing funny Kenya. That was crazy. It was a lot. I got enough problems of my own, honey. I'm trying to save my hair care line and all these What's retail stores. Girl, I have all these shipping issues. Like, it's a lot. There are so many things that have fallen by the wayside. So I think the immediate action, we need to know what your inventory levels are. Nothing is coming in from overseas. I don't know how to fix that. The good news is I had gotten offer of 5,000 doors at CVS and a new line at Walmart. That's what I'm like, it, how is it good if you can't? I can't even supply Sally. Right. So that's what we're working. See, you get business. Nobody else asked that question. <laughs> what do you need help to do? Packaging, components, like I'm figuring that all out now. We need a local supplier. I was getting everything from China. I've hired a COO. OK, yeah, so you got to... somebody that's going to figure it out. Yeah. At the level she's trying to go, you just can't go it alone. Most minority-owned businesses, that's where we have our issue when we're scaling up. Yes. If she gets a team, it's going to take her where she needs to be. Anyway, girl, I know there was so much drama that happened. Please do not allow Marlo Hampton to deter you from having a good girls' week I was with the rest of us. I was having a good girls' night, and she deterred me at the end from having a good time. Marlo cannot be trusted as far as you can throw her. And you know the bitch is six feet tall and weighs 200 pounds. So yeah, she ain't going too far. At one point, I went to the bathroom at Sheree's house. Marlo's in the bathroom, so I'm bumping her. I'm like, you've been nice all day. That's interesting. Then she goes into, I've been dealing with all this stuff with my nephews. And I was like, I just told him to get the f out. I just told him to get the f out. I was like, wait, what? What she's dealing with, with her nephews taking them in to live with her, I had that same thing with one of my cousins. Yeah. So that thing, when she said that, it just made me tear up because I could not imagine telling my cousin to get the yeah. out, you know what I mean? I end up having Riley and taking in my cousin Melvin when he was only 11 or 12 years old. Obviously, it's a lot when they're going through that age, but you figure it out.
I think I care more about how the boys feel because oh. adding to their trauma. Yeah, like you're Monty, like yes. you're supposed to say today. When she decided to take on responsibility for them, she should have accepted the fact that she was going to put her feelings to the side. What the I F? Need the water. Where the blaze go? She went over there. Go get her. Oh, uh, she in there. I don't want to talk anymore about any craziness. Come on, come on, let's go play with the kids. Where's my baby? Brooklyn?